Wait up guys, back from School Buses and today we're on Grand Turismo 7. Now we're going to be talking about the update that just happened and we are officially back on the game after a day and a few hours. So let's get straight into it. So zero point, uh, sorry, 1.08 fixed the whole game that because 1.07 broke the whole game because um, you could not progress to the world map which is just right there. You could not progress to it so it was impossible to play the game so they just decided to to extend the whole update and make it a 1.08 update so moving on so the options have been updated there I'm not really bothered uh, car settings if you are really bothered just read that right there but I'm, I'm just gonna go over the main updates uh, the lobby has been updated for your uh, missions and licenses uh, some modified assistant assist settings have been updated uh, missions, some f events have been stuck to uh, the wind speed's been stuck to zero or set to zero, should I say? And here we go. Okay, so we're going to be talking about the licenses. So, for the dirt driving licenses for the beginner, intermediate, expert, and lap attack, uh, this was for A8, which is the beginner dirt tyres, uh, that didn't have the dirt tyres. Uh, for IB5, the dirt track or the dirt license did not have dirt tyres. For IA3, did not have dirt tyres. And this has all been sorted. And the same goes for S5, the one lap attack. So all of them now have dirt tyres and it's the correct tyre to be on to get gold. Okay. The next one we're going to be talking about is the missions. So the first mission that's been updated with... Dirt tyres again is the Jeep Night Safari. That's with the uh, with the Willis Jeep, I think. The next one is going to be Beyond the Horizon, and the Beginner Drift uh, one has been updated uh, to Comfort Medium. I forgot. I, I'll I'll show you. Uh, the American Wilderness now has dirt tyres as well. For the Rolling Stone Beginner to uh, beginner drifting two. Uh, I got stuck on this because I just couldn't uh, drift with the racing tyres. Uh, this one's been set to comfort medium. Gone with the wind. Uh, Define moves on the spa. Uh, that has now been updated, and the intermediate drifting two has also been updated. Uh, where it says. Racing heavy to wet tyres, this needs to be on the Define Moves on Spa and not the Intermediate Drifting. Uh, the Sun also rises, the White Winged Beast, and this is on Racing Soft. So that's also been updated. Okay, moving on to Circuit Experiences. Colorado Springs uh, Circuit Experience has also dirt tyres. That's, uh, that's been updated. The Fishman's Ranch has also been updated to dirt tyres and the Sag Degna windmills has also been updated to dirt tyres. Okay so here is where it's going to be another main issue now hot topic basically the farming has been nerfed you was able to do 1.4 uh, per hour that was the max or you could get 1.5 1.6 at max on Fishman's Ranch depending how you either was on Sagnum Sad Degna Windmills, which are Fisherman's Ranch, which one's easier for you. Um, this has all been nerfed, it's all been slashed, and it's very annoying. But other circuits have been increased, but I still recommend doing the Dirt Championships. You don't have to do the Dirt Championships, you have to do the races instead, because the races are more, you get better outcome, and you can set that easier, and you get, uh, you can pretty much do it, and I'll show you the gameplay in the background. So basically here is going to be the list that's what's been updated. I can't bother reading the whole of this and showing you all the gameplay. But this has all been updated with the new uh, prices that you're going to get at the, or the rewards at the end that you're going to get. So my opinion, I'm going to stick with the rally stages because you still get 75k, uh, 750k per hour which is still good but very harsh. And a lot of grinding is going to happen just to get the trophies. And that is pretty much it. So we've got GT Auto has been updated. The garage has been updated. Uh, 
the physics simulation model has been updated. Uh, the, uh, adjusted the model to reduce the grip loss when the cars have high downforce are passing over a curb stone while cornering at its limit. And other things have been updated as well, as you can see right here. And that is pretty much it. So thank you for tuning in. Stay tuned for more. And I'll see you all soon. Adios.